Hi, my name is Lavish Kumar. In this video, we will learn how to add a new topic template in KnobCommerce. For this tutorial, we are using version 4.0. So KnobCommerce offers a great functionality of topic pages that allow store owners or managers to create pages right from the administration section without even touching the source code. So creating these topic pages on the fly from the administration section does not require any technical skill whatsoever. So if you're in the dashboard section, you can simply go into the content management and topic pages and right here you can manage all your pages. You can click a new page right by clicking at the add new button, put the title, the content, give a system name and you can display in the top menu footer. It's very easy. So a lot of topic pages are, are part of the knob commerce out of the box so you can see you can see about us page condition of use privacy information etc so here's an example here's the one topic page about us in which you can manage the content right from this section okay so so as you can see this is one page condition of use privacy notice shipping in return etc so all these topic pages are very consistent if you notice the layout and design of these topic pages is very similar but what if a store owner or manager wants to change the layout of a topic page what if you want topic page a to look different from topic page b well there's an inbuilt feature called topic templates in off commerce out of the box that allows you to choose different templates for different topic pages so by default, when you go into edit any topic page in the administration section, you are not going to see any option that allows you to choose the template. Here all you can see where you want to add the page, but there's no option for you to select the template. The reason is that there is only one template saved in NopCommerce site by default. So in order for you to enable this feature, you will have to add a new second template. In the back end in the code so just a note that you don't need a source code version for this change and update so I'm going to open the knob commerce project in Visual Studio you don't need Visual Studio to add a new page in this case so right here I have the knob app open our project and if you go into view and right here you'll see a folder called topic. I will stop my site for now. And within the topic folder, you'll see a topic detail page. And by default, this page is being used by NopCommerce. So all you have to do is, again, you don't need a full source code version. You can use a web version for this change as well. So I'm going to simply copy this. And within this folder, I'm going to paste it. And I'm going to name it because you have to give a unique name. I will give topic details new and save it. So now I have a topic detail new page. What I'll do is I will simply add a new section here just for you to take a look at it. Put in page body in this topic detail page new I will make changes I will add a heading here new topic template and I've saved it okay after saving I will run the project okay so our website is running now now I will again go to the administration section from the dashboard I will go to the systems templates and topic templates and here you manage all the templates for a topic so by default you can see I have a default template view path if I edit it, basically this is the name if I go into Visual Studio you can see topic detail page is the name of my default you in this case I'm going to update it the new template 
In fact, I will make it new topic template. View path will be the name of your page. In this case, we have given topic details new. And I will make it a display order as two and update. Okay, so this record has been added now. Now if we go to the content management, topic pages, and let's take an example of about us. Now because we have added another template, now you will start seeing the topic template option in the topic. And here you can see that our second newly added topic template is now showing up. I will open it for you so you can take a look at it. About us, this is using a default template. And when I select the new topic template page, save and continue. Okay, and now if I refresh it, you will see it's using a new template because if you remember, I added a heading in my new template and this is showing in this about us page. So now you can basically assign different design and layout to different topic pages as per your requirement. So this is how you can add new topic templates in NopCommerce. Now it's time for us to wrap up this tutorial video. Hope this was helpful. This video is brought to you by NopCommerce, open source shopping cart. Thank you.